Hello YouTube, it's me Shortage here back with a brand new video. So before we kind of start about the Lament Exotic Sword quest guide, I want you guys to look at these three missions on your screen. If you have not complete those three missions, I will require you to complete those three missions beforehand in my honest opinion. They're step four to the quest line, but I think mostly everybody should complete these already. You can get these quest line from the commander and Varix to prove yourself to Clovis AI. So for me, I didn't have that step. But if you have these in your inventory quest slots right now, complete those first before you start this quest line. And if you already did, the quest line will start for you automatically, thanks to wonderful guardians who beat in a raid yesterday and opened up more content on Europa. You will head to yourself to the tower to pick up the quest line from Banshee. There is an exotic sword that you need to complete or need to pick up or need to discover and you need to find three dead exos on Europa. That is step one. So you need to head there on Europa. Here is the list of three exos that I went to. There was one not far from the Vex Fortress and two in the Lost Sector, and that was fairly easy. But there's multiple locations you can find dead exos, and I will leave the links in the description down below for everything to find those dead exos and, of course, the quest guide. Once you find those three dead exos, you will locate a giant exo hidden in the exo facility, which is pretty cool. Like, this is a really beautiful area. I must say, Bungie did a really good job in these secrets on Europa. Like, there's a lot of deep secrets in this planetary sized map, and they did a really great job. It's really fun kind of going in and deep diving into this area. Once you find that, Clovis will get slick at the mouth, and, you know, he's... You know, he's a little cocky scientist and you have to prove yourself that you can wield this sword. There's a couple of challenges that he's giving you that he's recommending to see if you're worthy to have it. So to prove yourself to, for Clovis, he's an AI right now, by using swords against the Vex across Europa. Um, most of the activities and challenges, I stayed on Europa so they can count. I didn't even went nowhere else just to be safe. Uh, the Vex, you need to defeat uh, with swords. You need to defeat 100 of those. Metators, Hydras, and Cyclops swords, final blows are 20. And these are the key areas that I went to, you know, find Vex. And of course, that Lost Sectors has a tons of Vex in that area that you can get done very quickly. Once you do that, you need to prove your worth to Clovis AI by completing the Exo Challenge that dropped at the same time. Uh, this is the record power level of 1230. You can go in here by yourself if you want to. Or you can go in there with a fire team. It's really up to you and, you know, how your play style is. But I think you can complete it by yourself and with a fire team. So, you know, do that. I went in with a fire team just to be safe. And then um, you're pretty much good to go. Um, defeat the Vex with finishers and defeat powerful Vex, granted the most efficient process. Uh, that is the next part once you complete the Exo Challenge. Defeating the Vex with finishers, you need 60 of those. 60 to complete uh, the finishers and like it's mentioned defeating powerful vents vex will grant the most process at that step so i will say look for a powerful vex that will kind of help you out doing one vex at a time below the level like red bars it, it may the process may take a little bit longer once you do that you need to access the shrite the glassway and locate the blade pieces within you need to locate a hydra the little small hydra that comes up with the other big hydra and once that drops you it drop pretty quickly um, you can leave that strike. You don't have to complete that strike to move on to the next step. It drops automatically and moves on to the next step where you got to head back to the tower and speak to Banshee 44 again. The next part of the quest, you got to go to the abandoned bunker, which is a yeah, bunker 15, uh, which is on Europa. Explore that inside, complete the enemies in the area, and you completed that step. Once you completed that step, complete the mission reforged in the past to save Clovis AI from being destroyed by the Vex. He's going to reconstruct the sword right then and there and he knows that you are very worthy and he thank you for your service he's not a man that likes to thank people for their service but you have to say you had to save his ass at this point once you do that you know you clear all the enemies and stuff and you listen to the, di the dialogue from clovis you head back to the tower report your discoveries to banshee 44 and that is the end of the quest line if you guys have any questions or any concerns let me know in the comment section down below um Here's the, you know, the gear that I used. Here's the one that I use for the sword kills. If you don't have that from season 11, there's tons of swords. You can definitely get any sword will work for you, but mostly everybody got this from season 11. If you have not, 
just find another sword a blue sword a legendary sword can help you or even an exotic can help you out at that part i must say the lament exotic sword has been really fun to really use i'm going more in depth with this sword and it trust me it will help you a lot in the raid because this sword does a lot of damage to a lot of enemies in the meantime if you found the video helpful just leave a like on the video and i will see you guys in my next post